and the dog's deed is done. What can I say? They were the best. They really stood out. They put it all together when it counts, and that's what the sport's all about. What a routine. And that just may do it for Georgia here tonight. Wow. The Jim Dog Show is brought to you by Gem City Steel. Gem City Steel, serving the steel needs of the Southeast since 1978. Hello and welcome to the Georgia Gym Dog Show. I'm Kevin Kopp, joined as always by head coach Jay Clark. This week we break down Georgia's most recent win over Kentucky by a final score of 195.55 to 195 flat. As the Gym Dogs went back on the road to Lexington, coach, this is always a tough place to compete and to be able to walk out of Kentucky with a win by more than half a point has got to feel pretty satisfying. Well, it's good to get a win for sure. I don't know how satisfied we were. Uh, we're, we're we weren't really pleased with how we performed it overall. I thought there were some bright spots, and I thought bars and beam overall were pretty good. But vault and floor were a little bit disappointing. We gave away way too much on extra steps on landings and things that uh, that we shouldn't be doing this time of year. I don't, I don't mind if we don't stick everything, but we can't be having two steps on landings and leaving that many tents out on the table. When you, you, we had an opportunity to really get a really good road score. So we got the win, but but uh, you know our whole thing has been win today. And at the end of that meet, I think uh, every every person on our team would tell you that in our minds, we didn't win that day. And, and uh, we've got to improve uh, if we're going to stay in this thing. Well, Coach, you mentioned some bright spots. One of them right away was Georgia opening on bars with a 49-125. Let's take a look at the highlights from the first half of the meet. Georgia a 97.8 at the midway point after bars and vault. Here we are in Kentucky starting on the uneven bars. First time we've been through this rotation order as the first away meet was a quad meet. So we win an Olympic order. This one we start on bars and then we'll go to vault after this. You see Krista Tonello with a beautiful Higgins turn to a Jaeger, nice amplitude there. Her handstands are all very, very well done, getting them on top. I like to get her feet together right there when she does that bail to handstand. Just get her to tighten that up just a little bit. Nice giant full right here to double tuck to a stuck landing, and she gets us started right out of the gate with a 9.85, and we're off and running. Noelle Couch, the previous week, had had a, a break on bars. She's been very consistent in her training. Nice blind change to Jaeger right here. Good bail to handstand, toe shoot uphill. Another good handstand here from Noel. Good stretch off the top for this double front. She just steps back right there just a little bit. That's probably the biggest deduction in the routine. Gina Nuccio has a sprained ankle and is only doing bars for us right now. And uh, we're fortunate to have that because uh, it does hurt her a little bit when she lands bars, but we have gotta keep her going. Beautiful Ginger combination right there from the giant full. Her half in half out dismount that she normally sticks just shuffles her feet just a little bit. But part of that probably has to do with the fact that that ankle doesn't feel really good when she makes contact with the floor. Good handstand right there from Cassidy McComb. Giant full to Kachev. Very well done. Everything's on top at this point. Overshoot to handstand, uphill. Cassidy's got a nice routine going to this point. That handstand was a, just a hair short. And then she does a full out and steps back just a little bit on the landing, but a very nice routine. Cat Ding right on top with her handstand. And again, she's got a sprained midfoot as we tried to get her going on vaulting last weekend and we're not able to make much progress the first day she sprained her midfoot. So she's only doing bars and we weren't sure she was gonna be able to do that until we got to Kentucky. Nice half pirouette there on the low bar. Comes back to the high bar. Cat's handstands were very good in this routine as well. You see her double layout. She sticks the landing there. And then Shayla Worley rounds out our competitive lineup for the night with the Ray. Very well done. Toe on and off to handstand. Overshoot to handstand. This handstand right here is short. That's gonna cost her. Giant full, and then winds up for the double layout right here. And she lands it pretty solidly there. Cat Hires had trouble in warmups, but was able to give us a pretty good vault to start with. I thought the scores were a little tight there. She went 9.725 on that vault. It's a pretty good vault. We do get a little bent elbow there on the table. 
and the feet need to get a little more pointed but and a little pike down but not a bad vault all the way around and I think she's capable of going 985. This vault right here from Noel Couch just a hop there on that landing a good good solid vault 9675 so you can see uh, you know judging is different when you go different places this had good amplitude good rise off the table and just the hop there on the landing and they they really hit her for it hard. Then Cassidy McComb on vault. Nice vault, very big vault. That's the kind of vault we want her to do. Rather than to try to stall it and try to, try to stick it too much, which she did against Auburn, we really want the amplitude to be, and you can see she gets great rise off the table. So with only five vaulters going tonight, we went with just the Yurchenko full for Hillary Marr. It was a good vault. She did have the hop back on the landing, but it had nice amplitude and good rise off the table, good distance and she should be doing the one and a half again as we move forward uh, down the line. The Jim Dog Show is brought to you by Gem City Steel. Gem City Steel serving the steel needs of the Southeast since 1978. The Tenno Booster Club. The Tenno Booster Club is the official booster club of the Georgia Gem Dogs. Alpha Helicopters. Alpha Helicopters serving Atlanta skies for over 25 years. The Other Printer. The Other Printer. So many projects, so little time. And by Athens Orthopedic Clinic. Athens Orthopedic Clinic serving Georgia athletes for over 40 years. Become one of the first in the United States to use SlimMax, the amazing clinically tested backed by science weight loss breakthrough. Do you want to get back into your skinny jeans? How about a bathing suit? How about more self-confidence or just feeling better? Slim Max will help suppress your appetite, help your body burn fat, help increase your energy, help boost your metabolism. Dial now, toll free, 1-866-376-9051. 